What's going on guys? Today we are looking at the brand new AKA Aaron Rodgers. So here is Aaron Rodgers. This card is gonna be pretty interesting because we already have Joe Flacco who has Slinger 1, he's six foot six. However, I do think Rodgers is better, but it honestly is pretty close. 84 speed, great stats across the board. I mean, we're almost in the March now, so this is gonna be expected from new quarterbacks coming out. A 97 throw power, I think I already said that. 89 break sack, not really a mobile guy. We all know how Rodgers plays. But of course, it's the Slinger 1 release that is going to make Rodgers somewhat popular and probably a little bit overpriced. But I'm curious to kind of see what his price does settle at because Joe Flacco is so similar to him and already in the game. And for the abilities, he does get 0 AP Protected, 0 AP Identifier, and 0 AP Fearless. So pretty solid abilities as well as Hot Route Master and Pass Lead Elite. And don't worry, this card really doesn't need Gun Slinger. However, Slinger 1's release deep it has its problems i feel like if you're gonna use gunslinger on a slinger one quarterback you're gonna wanna you're gonna wanna use it for that deep release because that is where slinger one struggles in my opinion it's not really an opinion it's just a fact but short to mid it is the best release in the game and the main reason why i'm not running fearless today is because of this one ap pro reads ability he also does get brick wall which could be interesting against like spinner or that db fire blitz and he breaks the first sack while in the pocket. So an interesting little, little ability there that I might give a try out later today on stream. But pro reads, I like because it highlights. I mean, so that's the first part's not that big of a deal. Maybe for me, because I'm blind a little bit, it'll help me out. But highlights the first open target. But it also ignores pressure, which is super, super nice to have. So those are the abilities. Those are the stats. Let's hop into practice mode. Actually, no, no practice mode. You guys have seen Slinger 1 enough. Let's hop right into the game. Look at that. Look at Rod Rogers looks so good in that green and white, man. He really does. And we should get Kels wide open here. Rogers going to go ahead and deliver it. And sort of in, sort of out. We do get, actually got a broken tackle there. They didn't give it to me. They didn't give it to me, though, but I'll take it. He's running some pretty decent blitzes here. And you're going to see short to mid just how elite this release is. Um, I saw a couple, like, comments about Flacco and kind of about, this, about his release yesterday. Um, and I never really thought about it like this. I feel like it, it could result in more interceptions. But realistically, I mean, if you kind of are able to time the deep ball it's actually can be pretty decent we're gonna get that ball out quick as possible right there to george pickens but if you're able to like to kind of time and almost predetermine when someone's gonna be open the deep release isn't bad i notice myself a lot like i start throwing the deep ball when i know they're open and with slinger one it's tougher to do that the windows close up fast in this game especially right now with there being 99 speed 99 zone corners everywhere this is actually gonna be i might still be able to throw this i actually still did have it and you see right there oh i took a sack i should have done that Extra blitzer. Kelsey's open and oh we threw a pick. We threw a pick to, to right to Hassan Redding. Um, I don't know. That 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 brick wall ability seems very tough. Let's try to get some something open here. There we go. He's wide open over the middle. And there we go. Garrett Wilson makes a catch. Slam from Pickens. G dub on the Yeah, this should something's gotta get open here. There's no way something doesn't get open. We should have that right there. Rogers does get it there up the middle. Garrett Wilson turns the corner. Show me the speed, Garrett. Oh, we got the sideline animation. I feel like I don't even have that quick spin to the out. I should have that, though. Good ball right there from Rodgers. Nice little high throw. He's playing, shading underneath. Be the read. We should have Pickens open. Turn the corner, George. We don't get a broken tackle or anything. Okay, it's going to be a running back read. We should... Never mind. Why is he standing on the out? Does he know what's coming here? Cut back, and I maybe should have went all the way outside with that. Oh, my God. The read here is just George Pickens quick. Should have it, and if William Perry drops in the zone coverage, makes the play. William Perry drops in his own coverage and makes the... Are you... Are you kidding? <laughs> oh my God. Okay, who would I rather? Aaron Rodgers edition. And I'm not going to give you the whole spiel again. Let's just hop into some of these quarterbacks. I'm going to go with Rodgers over Mahomes. However, if you like throwing on the run a lot, if you have a lot of those boot passes in your offense, running gun Mahomes can be one of the best quarterbacks for that scheme. It's super frustrating to face. And that's the one thing I like about the Mahomes car, the running gun. The release, I don't like, but the running gun, if that's your play style, he's really good. I'm going to go with Brady over Rodgers. I'm going to go, okay, that's Rodgers. I'm going to go Rodgers over Burrow. Now, if you run the ball at your quarterback, you definitely might be able to debate Cole Pepper, but not really. I think Rodgers is just a better option outright. Um, this Mahomes, I'm going to go Rodgers, 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 Joe Flacco or Rodgers. It is, they are very similar, but Rodgers is better. Rodgers is better, but it's close. Um, you know, Rogers will probably, I'm not sure what his price is going to, you know, kind of sit at. He's at 700 K right now, but you know, Flacco for 450 to 400 is still probably one of the best buys at quarterback for like a top three quarterback in the game. So I do think Rogers is slightly better than Joe Flacco, but it is really close. And you know, it's like maybe like a hundred K to 200 K difference, to be honest. 
I'm going to go Rodgers over Wilson, Rodgers over this Brady card, Rodgers. Rodgers really the rest of the way here. Um, if you run the ball a lot, you could definitely say Lamar, but I'm probably still going to go Rodgers here. Um, I think Rodgers is a top three QB right now um, in Ultimate Team. Uh, he is um, he's definitely the real deal with that release. And even the abilities and the X factors are super nice. All right, here we go. Clean new slate. <laughs> Clean new slate. First game of the day did not go as planned at all. I would be lying if I said that is how I thought game number one was going to go today. But here we go. Swing pass, first play. Get into it here. Ed Reed, if he pulls Ed Reed, he really doesn't. Shouldn't be, He's not outside like he really should be. Jamal Charles turns the corner for a decent gain of five. I do believe that has been an issue for me. We're going to try a little high-low read here. I don't like Julius Peppers over the middle, but we should be able to get this high ball over the top right there to Kelsey. I've been really practicing that throw. Ted Hendricks, as you could probably imagine. Go ahead and spin that ball outside. I hate the rack animation. First down, no. That rack animation is awful. Come on, George. Get open, George. We actually we have the flat wide open, but we also have George wide open. Pickens makes a play. Skip that juke. Okay, there we go. He's got Carmichael out there on Carmichael, but we should get Kelsey wide open quick. There we go. And you see the immune, not only the immunity to pressure, but also that flashing, you know, the flashing uh, icon there. It's, it's nice. It's, you don't need it, but it's still nice to have. And let's try that midline read option again. Every once in a while, if you're able to pull this out, and he keeps reading Rodgers. If he's going to keep, if they keep doing that, I mean, it's not a bad thing on this, but okay, we should get Kelsey open here on the high ball. Kelsey high ball, and I thought he picked that off. Okay, I feel like he knew that. I don't know why I feel like he kind of knew that play. Not when he does that. And I like the end around off of it as, as well. Up the middle. George Pickens said, get off me. Touchdown, George Pickens. There we go. And fantasy owners, that does count as a touchdown for Aaron Rodgers. Okay, let's uh, dabble in some house rules. No blitz? Wait, what is going on? All right, we're going to give this a try. I don't know what this is. Again, like I said, but I want to get one more short little drive in. We're going to also try throwing the deep ball here. I really haven't showed it off in today's video. But let's give it the ball up here to Harold. There's that deep release. That should be a touchdown. Yep. Harold Carmichael on someone's head. Uh, I got to score 15 points. So we're going to go for two here. That means I, I, I guess we can run the we can run that little play again. The little uh, stack Y off play again. But there's that deep release for you guys who have never seen it before. And I don't know. This card's going to be fun to use. Like I said, I'll be live today on YouTube. See, if he, see what this guy does. Yeah, oh, I had the ball. I had it wide open earlier. He didn't throw it. My timing's off. But we got 11. Wait, is that only a one-point conversion? We should, we should have everything set up here. Oh, Kamara beat him. What's Kamara's best card? Yo, what's Kamara? Did Kamara just run by 97 speed Ronnie Lott? I, I don't think... George should get open. And it lights up as well. So I guess it... Does it, like, disregard when there's a... It must disregard when there's some kind of user in the vicinity. Because that was not open. I mean, it got open later, but like right when it lit up, it was a pick. It would have been very interesting if they gave him Gambler. I feel like Gambler is kind of like the Rodgers X Factor. Let's run here, Raj. Oh boy. Beam team, Cam Jordan. Okay, he's he's going to catch me there. Post low key and make Pickens a slant. Something like that. I mean, maybe this will work. A little backside slant action. And again, okay, I like how that lit up really early. Um, and he did actually get open, which is good to see. But okay, so, was, so like, can I only get... No, I don't think so. I, mean, I don't know. I don't, we're about to find out if we win the game here on this. Let's hope so. I feel like if I, feel like if I throw a pick as well, it probably means that if I throw a pick, he'll get points somehow. Let's see who's going to get open. Really? No. Oh, I forgot. I don't have the thing anymore. Okay, I just took my sack. I'll keep Carmichael that open, though. Exaggerated cross. Or we're gonna actually, we actually might have that. Over the middle. Good ball right there from Rodgers. Unfortunately, unfortunately, it hits the ground, but... Unfortunately, we couldn't make the play. We could try. What I'm looking for here. Uh, nope, he got really good. Yeah. Damn. All right, turnover on downs. Oh, balls on the ground? Someone's got to pick it up on our team, right? Okay, our ball. There we go. Especially on Marshawn Lattimore. I mean, Marshawn Lattimore's got a little bit of height to him, but like he ain't six foot eight. You know what I mean? He just ain't six foot eight. That should be a touchdown. Never mind. What does he have on him? <laughs> I can't believe this. Man, if you don't got deep zone KO, I don't know what this... He's at tip drill. And it's just going crazy against us. All right, we're throwing this quick to George. Playing crazy off coverage. We're just going to walk it up. Go ahead and swing it outside. There we go. Almost, He almost broke outside there. Cut in, cut out. Go with a skip juke there. Jamal Charles says, okay. I thought we maybe would have enough time to say get off me, but we didn't. Looks like looks like man to me. Throw this pass up. Carmichael's going to come down with that. Easy for the touchdown. And that took way longer than it probably should have. That should be game. 
And uh, yeah, I'll see you boys in the next one.